The Zika fears both here and around the world. More than 200,000 troops in Brazil are showing people how to get rid of the mosquito that spreads the Zika virus. Meanwhile, the governor of Hawaii has signed an emergency proclamation over Zika and other mosquito borne illnesses. Here in Texas, there are now 12 reported cases of the virus. That's one of the reasons today the city of Houston is ramping up its efforts to get rid of trash that could attract even more mosquitoes carrying the virus. Channel 2 Samantha Potashkin shows us what all they did. Solid waste trucks scatter across the Sunnyside neighborhood, scooping up loads of trash. Usually, we, they're alternating months with picking up heavy trash, but everyone doesn't follow that schedule. Resident Crystal Morris says heavy trash sites like this can get pretty bad, especially during the summer months. When it rains, it just gets puddled of water around the trash, and the mosquitoes like to be around that water and the wet area. That's why, in the wake of the Zika virus, a mosquito borne illness, the city is starting a trash roundup to reduce mosquito breeding. Grounds. We have a lot of children that play outside and they uh, ride their bikes up and down the street, and that would help them keep from getting all those mosquito bites and the virus. The special sweeps will happen every Saturday in neighborhoods across Houston. Texas now has 12 cases of the Zika virus. Seven of those are in Harris County. I hope it don't come here in this neighborhood. Especially in the Sunnyside neighborhood where illegal dumping is an ongoing issue, residents should eliminate standing water from their homes. And when it comes to trash, try not to let it pile up. Otherwise, there's no stopping the mosquitoes. I actually went and got the um, off deep woods for my kids so when they're outside playing basketball that they won't get bitten by the mosquitoes too bad. If you miss a collection day and you need to get rid of heavy trash, the city is encouraging residents to drop it off at their neighborhood garbage centers. Samantha Batashkin, KPRC Channel 2 News. And you can find a list of those neighborhood trash centers by going to our website, clicktohouston.com. That's where you'll find a link to this story on our homepage.